check it. Uh, we about to get ready to do another episode, drop one of break time. This in particular audience, we're in the Chicago area. There's like 7,000 people in the crowd. Uh, so instead of only doing a break time like I love to do, we added an add on to break time. That's right. It's called Michael Jr. I was wondering. It's like a bonus to a bonus. So instead of just me sitting down talking to the audience, I'll go ahead and let them ask me any question they want on any subject they want to ask. They only have to say, Michael Jr. I was wondering. Then I give them a reaction, a response. Some comedy could be created on the spot. In this episode, in this additional superhuman size episode of Michael Jr.'s Break Time. What's your name? My name is Dale. Dale, <laughs> yeah, that's right. You changed your shirt. I met you earlier. You changed your shirt. It's hard to tell. Little kids all look alike. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that was weird. All right, what's your question, Dale? I was going to ask My, you. The rules are simple, Dale. <laughs> it's Michael Jr. I was wondering. Michael Jr., I was, I wonder. Do you still remember me? <laughs> What's that? Do you still remember me? Yeah, of course I... Man, you got these people thinking you're my son or something now, dude. <laughs> yeah, we met earlier. This is getting weird. <laughs> Trust me, I've never seen that kid before in my life. <laughs> Next question. Any question at all? We got a microrunner over here, too. Any question at all? Cool. There's a young lady right here. What's your name? Lori. Hey, Lori. How are you? That's an awesome name. I like the name Lori. Where are you from? Panama City Beach, Florida. Oh, yeah, Panama City Beach, Florida. That's down there in Florida. And the summit, it's their 21st year, and that's my lucky number. Okay, that's so. enough. What's your question? <laughs> I'm just saying. Michael Jr., I was wondering if we could see you dance tonight. Oh. Yeah. Not at all. Next question. Next question. Next question. Okay. Right. Cool. What's your name? My name's Bill. 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 Cool. It's a weird name. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Bills always seem to show up in my life. I don't know if you noticed that. <laughs> Mine not. too. Like in the mailbox, it's kind of weird. What's your question, Bill? Michael Jr., I was wondering, how many people would we have to move to the moon in order to affect the tides? <laughs> yeah. uh, security? <laughs> that was awesome. Next question. Next question. <laughs> we, got, we got someone in the back. What's your name? Uh, Russell Christensen. Michael J. I'm, I'm wondering... sorry. Well, uh, there's too much going on right now. Michael J.'s a rapper. Um, I'm Michael Jr., but go ahead. What's your question? Michael J., I'm wondering why they call those chicken pieces drumsticks. They don't look anything like that. They look more like prehistoric clubs. <laughs> so you think it's cool to ask a black dude about chicken right now? <laughs> it's a little weird. It's a little weird. What's your name? You can stand up. You're passing them. Oh, it's a, oh, snap. It's a brother. What's up, man? Come What's on. up? Wait, 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 wait. Before you say anything, I'm going to tell you right now, like, this is a brother, bro. Like, I could tell by what's cracking, because sometimes, especially in this crowd, you don't know where the brother came from. <laughs> that brother, I'm, a, I'm assuming you, like, from here somewhere. Like, you didn't need a passport to get here? Where are you no, from? Where are you from? No, I'm from Alaska, Michael Jr. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's what I was saying. Um, <laughs> no, for real, for real. Like Alaska? Like Alaska, Anchorage, Alaska. And yes, there are brothers in Alaska. <laughs> uh, I'm going to say not anymore because you left. <laughs> yeah, so. That's close. Maybe when you get back. But, no, cool. What's your question, bro? It's an excellent segue. Michael Jr., I was wondering, will you ever make it up to Anchorage, Alaska? We'd love to have you there. Oh, cool. Um, you know, I actually went to Alaska. There's a, there's a city there, and you can verify this. There's a city there called uh, North Pole. <laughs> For real, is there a city called North Pole? You were born in North Pole. A brother in North Pole. <laughs> Man, Santa Claus wasn't only getting cookies, was he?
One more question, last question, right here. Hey, what's up, bro? I'm gonna go passport on you. I'm just filling passport. Could be wrong. Where you from? The Dominican Republic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew it was a passport involved. I could tell by the way you rose up. What's your name, sir? Eric. Eric. I like how you put the K on the internet or the C or whatever it is. Surprisingly, there's no K at the end of it. It's just E R I C, but it's okay. What just happened? <laughs> you just you pronounce the C or whatever. I've never written you a letter. I don't know how you spell it. I'm just saying, I love how you announce it, the, e, the, the C at the end. That was good, Eric. Okay. <laughs> what part of the Dominican Republic are you from? The capital, Santo Domingo. Yeah. Any Dominicans here? Yeah, I, I have a friend who got a cousin that went there once. <laughs> so yeah, it was the Dominican Republic for which Surely stands. we'll have to go again because it's a beautiful country, One nation, beautiful island. Under God, individual. <laughs> Cool, yeah, I'm gonna have to trust you, man. So, all right, what's your question? Okay, speaking about countries, we The rules that... are simple. It's Michael Jr., I was wondering. I don't know how you do it in the Dominican Republic, My... but <laughs> go ahead. Michael Jr., I was wondering if you could tell us what is your favorite country in the world, aside from your country, the U.S. Okay, my favorite country in the world. My favorite country. Um, <laughs> I got some stuff popping up. I'm not gonna say I wanted to say. Um, you ever been to Alabama before? <laughs> yeah, it's a whole nother country. It's a whole nother country. One of the things I really, really like about Michael Jr., I was wondering, is simply the fact that it opens up dialogue. There's always gonna be some times where you feel a little, uh, how can I put this? A little upset with someone else. Maybe you think they said something or did something or whatever the situation might be. And the best thing to do is to roll up on them and just say, hey, Michael Jr., I was wondering. Actually, that would be weird. You just simply say, I was wondering if we could talk and open up the dialogue, because if you don't, there's going to be some dialogue going on in your head that probably doesn't even match with what's really going on. So I'm telling you, just simply make that approach and it's going to make everything else way smoother. Communicate, bring it to light and then things is gonna be probably more than all right. Boom, there you go, just dropped a little something. Here it is right here. <whistles> Boom, <laughs> oh, that one bounced. That was pretty awesome. I'm Michael Jr., I appreciate you. We about to take some questions. Yo, so here's the point where we take some questions from some people. Somebody, well, how do you say his name? Lapice23 wants to know um, how many years I've been married. Man, that's easy, shoot. Um, yeah, let me get back to you on that. Don't forget to subscribe. Like right now, hit the button, subscribe. What do you do, Michael Jr., when your punchline doesn't work? Um, <laughs> I don't put it on stage. Yeah, I don't just randomly just, like you don't just buy a car. Like I like that car, that's, like you gotta, you gotta test drive it first. You know, just, yeah. Post a break time on your Facebook. That'll be dope. Michael Jr., I was wondering, what is the reason you pick Wednesday for your break time? Well, um, I didn't have a lot going on on Wednesdays, so I figured that would be a good time uh, to take a break. Since I was already not doing anything, I could take a break and not do more. Don't forget to leave your questions in the comment section below. Maybe yours will get answered. Cool. Why did you choose comedy as a career? Comedy as a career. Actually, you know what? I, I really have a bigger purpose than just comedy. Comedy is just the what I do to get to the why I do it. It's pretty deep. And don't forget, come to a Michael Jr. show. You could see your break time live. Like you could be in the audience. You could be a part of break time. Then you can go ask a question about break time. And it'd be like, yo. So come to a show. All the information is on MichaelJR.com. Don't put in MichaelJr.com spelled out because it's a little kid selling vacuum cleaners.